Earth and environmental systems um, and all the fields that that encompasses is important not only for Central Asia but for the entire planet um, because because the field is is one that works right from the the very local level up to the global level. My career path has been an exciting and different collection of uh, careers because Earth and Environmental Sciences is a very diverse range of topics. But at high school I was really interested in sciences and um, when we got offered upper level courses we had this new one and it was called geology and I didn't really know what geology was. And I asked the teacher and they said, do you like science? Do you like chemistry? Do you like biology? Do you like physics? And would you like to combine all of those uh, sciences? And uh, I did. I love science. My background is in astrophysics. Kind of the connection between astrophysics and earth and environmental science, I would say, is that it's all the science and the physics in particular for my interest of understanding how the world works or at the largest scales how the universe works. Um, global level being things like climate change, um, uh, knowing how huge processes work, mountain building processes, plate tectonics, um, that type of thing brings us into learning about resources which is something at a regional level or, or smaller scale level. I started with engineering and I wanted to bring electronics and instruments outdoors to study glaciers. So I was involved in the oil industry and mining exploration and I was given an opportunity to teach some of these subjects at the University of British Columbia and since then I have been teaching uh, geophysics, I've been teaching earth, uh, earth sciences, uh, general uh, geological topics and natural hazards. So this new science for me, geology, where I could actually apply those sciences rather than just learn the theory of them, was really exciting. Earth and environmental sciences is um, particularly important to the, the, um, uh, to the growth and the sustainable use of the Central Asian region for almost all types of people, whether they live in the city or whether they have the luck to live in a place like we have here with mountains nearby and clean, fresh water. With EES, you get to work with this environment as your office. Earth and environmental sciences is, is really a critical part of, of developing and learning about a region like Central Asia.